what needs what I would like to see is people answer honestly within that little framework. No, that framework you can't win. Just jump out. You just say to them, okay, how do you pay off the national debt? Simple. Let's say to the left, it's okay. The U.S. has $150 trillion in unfunded liabilities. How are you going to pay for it? Yeah, the U.S. government has promised more than $150 trillion. It has no money to pay. How are you going to pay for it? We're going to raise taxes on the wealthy. Okay, show me the math. Show yeah, me the luck. fucking math, genius. Good luck. Uh, magic? <laughs> right? <laughs> and it's like, okay, <laughs> listen, there's... <laughs> There's uh, one of my favorite movies called The Room of the View. I've never seen it. <clears throat> you should watch it. It's a, it's a great movie. It's a great, great movie. And okay. um, in it, I won't get into the details, but in it, one guy asks a bunch of questions of another guy, and he's, they don't really have an answer. And he's like, oh, so you haven't really thought about this seriously at all, so why should I bother listening? It's like, blah, 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 blah. Okay, the U.S., how much does the U.S. have in unfunded liabilities? Oh, I don't know. What's the U.S. national debt? Oh, I don't know. What's the U.S. Um, deficit? Well, I don't know. Uh, what's the biggest items in the U.S. Uh, deficit budget? Or what's the biggest items in the U.S. budget? Well, I don't know. It's like, well, why the fuck should I listen to you? You don't know anything. Like, why, why should, why could you, how could you be so stupid as to think that anybody should listen to you about a subject you know nothing about? And even if they do know these numbers, say, okay, how are you going to pay? How are you going to pay for these unfunded liabilities? Uh, <laughs> magic, <laughs> right? I mean, you can't. These unfunded liabilities cannot be paid for. So don't give me this, there's a future with no suffering bullshit. There's no future without suffering. The hole has been dug so deep, there is going to be no future wherein no sacrifice is going to be required. And you know what? This sacrifice will make us better. I wish it weren't true. I wish it wasn't going to happen. But by God, it's going to make us better. Because you know what? We are so fucking deluded as a culture in the West. We live in such mad, insane, deluded unreality. Fiddling while Rome burns. Arguing about how many migrants we can possibly take in when we can't afford any of the promises we've made to our citizens.